Hi everyone and welcome to JSA TV where we are coming to you today from the floor of Tech Capital's International Finance Forum in a beautiful venue here right in the heart of London. I'm Barb Mitchell and I am pleased to be joined by Michael Gord who is the CEO of GDA Capital Flashy Finance. Michael, thank you so much for joining us. Pleasure, thank you as well. It's a, you know, a very busy day planned here today at the International Finance Forum. I know that you're part of the agenda. We're going to talk about that a little bit later. But if you wouldn't mind first just starting by telling us a little bit about your organization. Cool. Yeah, so in general, I'm a serial entrepreneur and investor. I've been focused on blockchain adoption since it started pretty much. GDA Capital is a privately owned uh, investment and advisory company focused on the mainstream adoption of digital assets. We have about 70 portfolio companies across all aspects of blockchain technology. And Flashy, Flashy Finance is a financial infrastructure provider to internet culture. So we're turning games, music, social networks, social networks in general, videos, uh, content, memes, et cetera, into modern digital banks. Um, yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Huh. Uh, I feel like we could talk more about that, but I want to let's let's switch to a topic that uh, y you know is top of mind for so many people, especially in the digital infrastructure space, and that's around AI, right? And so, talk a little bit about what you're seeing the impact uh, being of of the growth of AI. Yeah, so I see a couple couple big trends. I'm also approaching this from a pretty different lens from the majority of the people here. So what I'm excited about with AI is uh, with this um, agenda is AI computes and the opportunity to cash flow and to build, I think, better incentives for data centers. AI is just a, a, a more exciting asset class to be providing compute for and it is more profitable. So I'm invested into some AI compute businesses and then I'm really excited about decentralized AI as a, uh, instead of centralized AI businesses. So that's a whole other topic, but yeah, yeah really excited about that trend. I, and so I, I hinted earlier that you're on a panel this afternoon. Can you, can you tell us a little bit about what are you gonna be talking about? So the panel is about innovations in renewables and green energy, um, which the other panelists are talking about that from a data center perspective. I'm talking about it from a blockchain infrastructure perspective with private equity opportunities built on top of the blockchain infrastructure layer. Um, yeah, green energy innovation. <laughs> All right, and so when you look to sort of final bonus question here, when you sort of look to your business and your client base and, and uh, the work that you're doing, what do you see are the largest trends that are, that are impacting your business? Uh, I think blockchain technology, AI, Blockchain technology and AI, I would, I would yeah. say, are the biggest trends right now. Yeah, definitely concur. <laughs> I think that that's a, I, I think that most people would agree on on that. And so, well, and also, if I can, decentralize physical infrastructure um, and uh, democratizing access to these types of asset classes that are traditionally institutional to the crowd. So I'm excited about that. Okay, I, I want to. I just want to hear if you can expand on that for last question. I promise, just expand on that the democratization uh, piece that you just mentioned. Right now, data centers are purely institutional, so it's uh, institutional businesses are raising institutional capital to create energy infrastructure that they sell to the grid. The future of decentralized physical infrastructure is anyone and everyone can be a node to a quote unquote data center, but that is run by a international collection of, for example, phones or, for example, computers where the uh, where percentages of revenue, cents of revenue are rewarded to the crowd for contributing their computing power as opposed to it purely being institutional. Interesting. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, any final words that you want to leave us with here today? Uh, I hope that the future becomes flashier. Yes. <laughs> flashy. Flashy finance. Thank you so much. Very great to talk to you today. Very much appreciate your time. Enjoy the rest of the day. Good luck on your panel. Pleasure. Yeah. Thank you very much. And thank you to our viewers for tuning in to JSA TV. Until next time.